Hello everyone, this is Christina and Andrea talking about global education. At the YWCA, we have a very specific curriculum about global education in which every month we have different principles that we want to cover related to global education. This month, our special topic is human rights and children rights. So for this week, we have designed very fun activities related to the book that is called I Have the Right to Be a Child. Uh, this book describes all the various rights that children have and human rights in general, but specifically relating to children um, with the little kids. Uh, I will of course be reading out loud to them so that they can understand each page. Uh, and with the older kids we would like to have them read out loud from second to fifth grade to have them read out loud. And then we want to also discuss each right and discuss why they have these rights and why they're important. Um, after we learn about our rights, then we want to do a rights activity for the little babies, right? The first kindergartners, second and third, they're going to do this project here. If you can see, um, it has a bunch of different wants and needs on there. And everybody's going to get one of these papers. And Jira's going to be my student. She gets okay. a paper. And then I'm going to pull out each one of these from my bag here. I have every single one here in my bag. And I'll pull one out individually. And I'll say, oh, this item is... Clothing, but it's nice clothing. Fancy I have it. clothing. Is it a want or is it a need? Yeah, a need. It's a need. Well, clothing is a need, but fashionable clothing is not, right? So we can oh. discuss why there are differences between having just clothing or having fancy clothing. And we'll go through the entire project, the entire list, one by one. And once their sheet is filled out bingo. at the end, they get bingo. And then bingo means you get a tattoo. Everybody gets a tattoo, they glow right. in the dark, they're super cute, and they're, they wash off, of course. The older kids, we want them to think a little bit more critically, so we'll have this version. Um, it's all needs or rights, there's no wants here, but um, there's some nuance to these rights, right? And then on the bottom, there's blank spaces, so we want them to actually create their own ver um, rights, or not create their own, but make their own drawings of the rights, so that we understand that they understand what their rights are. And then we'll also play bingo with the cards, and at the end, everybody gets a tattoo. Great. Thank you. Have a good week.